here's a tender poem, something different. So I was, I was at this residency in uh, Canada, in Alberta, and uh, I would recommend going there. It's run by women, you can get scholarships. But I was there for a while and I started writing poems about elk and I thought, uh-oh, um, <laughs> I better get home soon. <laughs> So this is called The Kindness. The mother elk and two babies are sniffing the metal handle of the bear-proof trash bin. I remember the instructions for city people, three football fields of space between you and the elk if their babies are with them. I'm backing up slowly, watching the calves run into each other as they bend to eat grass, look up at the mother at the same time. The caramel color of their coat, the sloping line of their small snouts, and I want to hold that beauty, steal it for me. But I'm only on football field number two and backing into the woods past the lodgepole pines. Their fragility, their awkward bumping, opens me to a long ago time. A hand on the door. I was walking into the psych hospital in Pittsburgh feeling broken and stripped down. A hand on the door from around my body, and I looked up to see the body of a man who said, let me get that for you. A hand on the door and the bottom of me dropped. I couldn't breathe for the kindness. I couldn't say how deep that went for me. I had been backing up awkward. I had been blind to my own beauty.